The bond between Loma and Larry Coven runs deeper than their 38 years of marriage. When Larry became sick with polycystic kidney disease and needed a transplant, Loma volunteered. I'll do it. <laughs> you know. After extensive testing, surgeons decided Loma would donate her right kidney. Left kidney nephrectomies can be performed laparoscopically, but removal of the right kidney requires open surgery. The right kidney we couldn't do laparoscopy because the right renal vein is short and we didn't have an instrument that will give us all the vein that the kidney can be transplanted to the recipient uh, without uh, complications. Those complications have cleared a hurdle. Dr. Rezgo Galli, a urologist at UAB, has made a breakthrough in how right nephrectomies are performed. He redesigned a pair of surgical clamps, allowing him to remove the right kidney laparoscopically, sparing the donor a long and painful recovery. We use uh, as a start the clamp which, which you use in open surgery. Then we made different versions of a new clamp which will give us the same advantage but laparoscopic. When you put this inside the abdomen with these dimensions, it's fitting on the inferior vena cava that it's very easy to climb the inferior vena cava, cut the renal vein, and the suture that laparoscope. Loma Coben was the first patient to benefit from these specially designed clamps. He told me that it would only be a small incision, which it was. It's only about a, I'd say a three inch incision just above my navel. And, you know, the rest of it was just little punctures is what I call them. And you stop and think about that. You measure that against the the big incision and how long it takes you to get over that. Six months later, Larry's new kidney is functioning perfectly. He's enjoying his new lease on life. It's uh, better than falling in love again. <laughs> Just about. 